Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. Robert Huntington Adams was an American lawyer and elected official who represented the state of Mississippi in the United States Senate. His story begins in Rockbridge County, Virginia, where he was born in 1792. As a young man, Adams learned the craft of barrel making and went on to graduate from Washington College, today known as Washington and Lee University. Adams relocated to Natchez, where he quickly rose to prominence. He was elected to the Mississippi House in 1828. Just one year later, the Mississippi legislature chose Adams to fill the U.S. Senate seat vacated by the recently deceased Thomas B. Reed. Adams was sworn into office on January 6, 1830, and was almost immediately recognized as an outstanding orator. He served during the winter and spring of that year, returning to Natchez in May for the congressional recess. On this day in history, July 2, 1830, Adams tragically fell ill and died at the young age of 38. In remembering Robert Huntington Adams, Senator Henry Stuart Foote said, there was no knowing what amount of fame he might have acquired or what wonders he would have achieved upon the theater of national affairs had he not died so young. Fittingly, Adams is buried in Adams County at the Natchez City Cemetery. I'm Roger Wicker, United States Senator for the state of Mississippi, and this has been your Natchez History Minute.